Sydney Hill Church. I hope you're going really well. I just wanted to give you a little recap on the last couple of weeks. Easter 2022 was amazing. It's been a couple of years since we've been able to have a Good Friday and a Resurrection Sunday service. Uh, what an item that Taran uh, performed. I got told a story uh, that there were a heap of children at the back of the church doing their colouring in. And the moment that item started, they stopped what they were doing. They started staring at Taran as she did an interpretation of Mary Magdalene and her love for Jesus Christ, her Saviour. Those kids were so still and quiet. That's right, in church, that's an Easter miracle. <laughs> also, we came around the message out of Romans 4.25. It's a great scripture that says, He died on the cross for our sins, but he was raised for our justification. We were blessed this year and it was a phenomenal Easter. Then the very following weekend was Anzac Day. Uh, that was also an amazing weekend. We had a last post live in the service. We've never done that before. And I think I could speak on behalf of everybody that was there, but there was such a deep feeling of gratitude. One, towards Jesus Christ and his sacrifice that he made for us on the cross. But two, all the people of service in the army, all the Anzacs that have served and made sacrifices for our country and our freedom. It was a fantastic day. And we came around the scripture out of the book of John, which says, No greater love than the person that will lay down their life for their friends. Jesus said that. It was an incredible, incredible service. Now, coming up over the next few weeks, we've got some great things. Mother's Day is coming. That's going to be a wonderful service. We've got an opportunity where you can get a family photo in the Mother's Day photo booth. There's going to be a gift for all the women. There's going to be a morning tea. There's going to be a great message from Annalisa Colo called Love the Genes You're In. And that's G-E-N-E-S. So that's a little play on words and that's going to be a phenomenal topic. And then also on May 22nd, we need to do another baptism service. There's so many people wanting to be baptised. And if that's you, we'd love you to make that decision because what you're saying to the world is that you are going to live for Jesus Christ. It's a public statement that you do when you go through the waters of baptism. If that's you, click on the button below and one of our team will be in contact with you soon. We love you, church. We pray for you daily and we can't wait to see you very soon and most likely on the weekend. Have a great week.